Hi, I'm Dr. Melissa Mann. I am a certified facilitator with Access Consciousness, and I wanted to do a little series um, on business and starting your business from scratch and what it means to sort of go into business and all the projections and expectations and separations and judgments and rejections that we have around what business means and what it means to have a business and all the ways that you've decided that you can't or that it's too hard or too overwhelming. And I kind of wanted to just take a few videos to just get you to like the willingness, the beginning stages of like, okay, well, if I was actually willing to have a business, what would that look like? And what would my life be like? And so this little video series is kind of about like the, the pre-stage, the stage before you even really start on your business. And, um, and after this, um, sometime in the next few months, there'll be a series called Starting From Scratch. And that will be a little bit more of like the nitty gritty stuff. So this is kind of like the prequel to that, if you will. So what I wanted to do first is, I mean, this three videos and this first video, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about like just the energy of your business. And if you're new to access consciousness, that's not something you're familiar with, you're probably like, what? So, and if not, maybe it's a little less strange to you, but part of how we generate things in our lives is being willing to like have an idea. And that's like the generation part. And then we, you know, take steps, do choices, you know, uh, create things to like bring something into the world and actually implement it. But before any of that can occur, we actually need to have the energy of what the business is so that you like even having the thought already like you've created this entity of the business in the world and once the business is even a thought it exists and it exists like the energy of it exists and so i mean everything has consciousness and so your business has consciousness even the business that's like sitting over here that like you haven't actually done anything with yet it still has consciousness so then we get to pull into like, what would we really like that to be in the world? And what would our lives be like if we were willing to have the business to bring the idea into the this reality as like an actual like entity that you're playing with and asking questions to and, um, and receiving from all things that maybe you didn't even know you could do with business. But your life is business and your business is your life and you're always playing in that and as as long as you are like awake and breathing and functioning in the world like you're in business now so there's that piece of it but then it's also like getting that like you starting a business you creating this business is something that like getting the energy of will just make it so much more ease and then it will allow it to contribute to you and you can contribute to it and you can be in communion with it. So what I'd like to do in this first video is what we call an energy pull. And so it's really just like pulling up the energy of all the things. And so it's kind of like a meditation, but not if you're new to energy pulls, it's, it's kind of like an active meditation where you're actually like pulling energy into something. And if you're like, what do you mean pulling energy? So you don't actually have to think about it. This isn't a visualization and it isn't um, something that you have to like do anything with other than just ask the energy to pull and it will pull. So what I'm gonna have you do is just relax. So take a deep breath and just like come into like wherever you're at. I mean, if you're driving, you know, don't close your eyes, but if you're anywhere else, close your eyes and just like relax. Take a deep breath. Okay. So now from this space, you close your eyes if you can and just get the energy of what it is you'd like your business to be. And it doesn't have to have words, but it's not wrong if it does. And get the energy of your life by bringing this business into it. And what would this business be? So what are the elements that would make it fun for you? 
So it might be that you want to go into calculation and computation of like, well, it needs to have this many people or this product needs to be like this, or I need to figure out how to, um, you know, how to bring this thing to the world or what systems do I need? So I want you to set all of that aside right now. We're not there yet. Right now, just pull all your barriers down and everything that you've decided that the business is and everything that you've decided that business isn't, be destroyed and create it. Right, wrong, good, bad, pot, pot, all nine shorts, boys and beyonds. And let it go. What if your business could be so different from anything that you've decided it has to be or should be or needs to be? What if it could be a contribution to your life? What if it could be a contribution to the world? And pull your barriers back down. Everywhere you're like, but my business doesn't contribute to the world. Please destroy it and create that. Right, wrong, get bad, pot, back, all night, shorts, boys, and beyond. You being you, and you having the joy of you, and you being willing to put that into the world is a massive contribution to the world. Yeah. So get the energy of the business. Let's go back there. What does it contribute to your life? What is the energy that it contributes to the world? What does your day look like playing in this business? What is the energy of your life as you actualize this business? What is the energy of the business? Just get a sense of your life three months in the future, six months in the future, five years, 10 years, 100 years, 500 years. I know, it doesn't have to make sense. So for me, it helps to have like an energy ball out in front of me. If that works for you, feel free to join me in that. And all those energies that we're pulling up of your business and your life and the joy of it and the ease of it and the fullness it creates for your life. And start playing with how many hours a day would you want to like play in it? What would be the energy of the people that you would like to play with you in your business? What would be the, how much money would you like to make in your business? How much money would your business like to make you? What jobs would you like your business to have? And get the energy of all of that. And start to pull energy into that, into your energy ball if you have one. And pull more. And pull more. And pull until you start to feel your heart open up. And as you pull energy into your energy ball, it can go through there and through the front of you and out through the back of you. And continue to pull. When your heart starts to open up, start to trickle little, little trickles of energy back out into the world. To everyone and everything that would contribute to your business. and ask that this energy continues to run even when we've stopped this. And the energy pulls and pulls and pulls and the little trickles continue to go out to everybody in the world. Everyone looking for what you have. Everyone looking for what you offer. Everyone looking for you. And when you're ready, you can open your eyes. And you've begun. That's all that it takes. And we'll do a couple more videos and a little bit more on sort of the logistics of playing with business as the prequel to 
maybe the action steps. So I hope you guys have an amazing day and I will see you tomorrow.